All right, how's it going? Uh, going to be doing myself another Political Machine 2016 presidential run. I just barely won the last one with HateBot 5000. Let's see if I can once again get things done with HateBot 5000. Uh, let's see. Oh, they have little... Uh, this must be some update, because they actually have... Uh, they actually have uh, uh, little little things here. And they I think they have new people. I don't remember John Kerry being in here. Or Kucinich. Sanders. Obama's on here now. I think Al Gore was in there. I kind of want to go up against John Kerry. <laughs> I don't think Bloomberg was here last time either. Fuck, I'll go up against John Kerry. Why not? He seems pretty easy. Yeah. Yeah, why not? <laughs> Plus, I love his face in this game. <laughs> Alright. Alright, let's see. How am I going to start this? Let's build the HQ. Upgrade the HQ. And then do a bit of fundraising. And... This is how we'll spend the first time around here. I'm not too worried about losing Texas. Uh, let's raise some funds. Because I'm going to need a, a healthy amount of funds here to get over here. And... Outreach Center! Clout, clout, and more clout! Oh, give me money. There we go. I'll do one more. There we go. So now I should have enough time. Get that last clout center up there. Move over to Florida. Build another outreach center. And I'll create an ad. I favor fighting ISIS. That's right. Hatebot is all about war. That's all he knows is war. 12. All right, we need 17. So we're going to wait on that. There we go. Uh, still need another one. All right. I forget. How many does that give me now? Let's see. That was... No, that's carries. 7... 7 and 10 so far. Oh, he's got the Environmentalist Club. That's fine. Uh, let's see here. Support for Israel because they're at war. And Hatebot loves war. You know who loves Hatebot? Who loves Hatebot? Do women love? Women love Hatebot. Women love Hatebot. There we go. Alright. Uh, let's see here. Should we just stick in Florida for right now and then just try to take this swing state and just... absolutely try to demolish it? Turn this bad boy red? There we go. Let's move to uh, let's move to uh, Ohio. I'm really not too concerned about. All right, we're gonna raise some funds here. We're gonna get another outreach center going, and with all of that, we're going to come over here because I need to raise more funds. Hello. All right. Black people love hate bot. <laughs> uh, let's see. There's definitely fighting ISIS. So we'll worry about we're, we'll worry about uh, fighting ISIS. And then we'll come over here. And we'll get ready to uh, 
Use some stuff there. Um, get a speechwriter. 17. Okay, we're still... Still waiting on some stuff there. How many... How much do we do we get? We get 11 clout a week. Okay. Not bad. But I'm trying to steal more of Carrie's endorsements. So if we wait one more week, we should be fine there. Let's see... Resettlement of refugees. Now we're we're all about ISIS. That is that is all we that is all we care about is ISIS. We shall spread the word of killing ISIS. That shall be Hatebot's message. And the Civil Liberties Union love love his message of fighting ISIS. Is it 250? Hmm. We need to we need to like build up some money making deals here. I think once we start getting the clout together, that's when I'll. All right, I'm gonna do a. There we go. We want we want ISIS to be the uh, thing here. So we're gonna move over here, and we're gonna start getting some money to build to upgrade that clout center. Let's get that taken care of. All right. We have enough. We'll make an ad because we have enough money to do that. Isis. Oh, oh hang on. Hang on before he gets anything. Uh Unions love hate bot. And upgrade and upgrade. And now Carrie won't be stealing any of my shit. I should go to New York. New Yorkers would love hate. They love hate. Uh fashion consultant, PR consultant. Uh let's do PR consultant. For right now. Alright, campaign headquarters is definitely something I'm going to need. Meanwhile. And we're going to raise some funds while we're at it. Political opportunity. 5,000 gets a powerful head start. Doing pretty well. I'd have to say that. California is a red state. As of right now, I'd say I'm doing pretty well. Uh, let's see. Who loves Hatebot? No, gun. Uh, no. Yeah, Christians. Christians love Hatebot. Christians love the Hatebot. Woof. And we're going to give a speech on ISIS. And ISIS. And then to top it off about ISIS. The war on terror is also there too. So we shall we shall make him, let's see, war on terror. Oh, National Foreign Policy Committee. Oh yeah? Gun owners love hate bot because of course they do. War on terror. And now we can get that PR consultant. All right. What do we got here? Now, most of them resettlement of refugees. I should probably oh, securing the borders is also a big thing. Gun rights. Gun rights and resettlement of refugees are two things I should work on as well. Massachusetts. You know what they call you guys? They call you guys mass holes. I'm sure you guys will love hate. So we're gonna fight ISIS. <laughs> this is a this is a very fun fun thing here. Uh, let's see here. Uh, businesses businesses love hate bot. And we're gonna put some more money down on this. 
cool. ISIS is up there now. War on Terror. I bet you we could build that up. If we go around to enough places, I think we've got a good chance. Aha, tea partiers. They love hate bot. This is working out. I enjoy this. I like the little music. I think I'm gonna... That's the way to turn this up. So it could actually be heard. There we go. Oh god. Oh good. It changes now. Damn it. Just what I didn't want. What? Oh, fuck off. I support war! I wonder if that 40% awareness is for me or somebody else. I'm doing a pretty good job making myself known in places. Let's go get Iowa. Iowa needs to embrace the hate. Hello there, Iowa. Let's get some money. And then fighting ISIS. I have the opportunity to appear on 60 seconds. Hang on. I must spread my wealth of knowledge. Alright, where is it? Utah! Would I like to appear? Sure! <laughs> Reporters investigate the under seedy, seedy underbelly of office supply retailers. Do you know where your staplers come from? I'm Leslie Danger. That story and more tonight on 60 Seconds. Obamacare has been contentious ever since it was introduced. What is your stance? Uh, considering he's Republican, I would say we need to repeal it. Yeah. Uh, fallout from the debt crisis in Greece, do you think it's time we'd be concerned about our own debt issues here? Uh, uh oh boy, let's see. Tackle debt? Yeah. Okay. I did it! I know how to answer questions like a Republican. I'm a real boy now. Let's go to swing states. My mom would be so proud. I lie. My mom would hate that. Alright, so they already know me, so let's go to some places that are still gray, because people don't know people there. Hey, another national organization to help swing some stuff there. Bathroom bill? Uh, can I get a, can I get a dealio on what the bathroom bill is? Many states have caused so-called bathroom bills require people to use bathrooms based on their biological birth gender. Supporters say that, oh, this is a transgender issue. Supporters say the laws are necessary to discourage predators. Others feel the laws needlessly discriminate against members of the transgender community who wish to use the bathroom. Well, Hatebot doesn't care about bathroom bills. Hatebot only cares about war. So, fighting ISIS. It is ISIS for everybody. Now to West Virginia. Where we shall spread the word of hate to West Virginia. We'll build a campaign headquarters so we can get some more money. That helped. Oh, securing the borders. We should really do some securing the border stuff, too. Um, let's see. Illinois would be another, another good-sized one to have. Can we, can we move? Not enough money to perform this action. Ow. There, now we have money. Another national organization has endorsed us. 
fighting ISIS. Securing the borders. People should not have the American dream. We should only produce hate. Fighting ISIS. Securing the borders. And let's go ahead and bring securing the borders up. There we go. Uh, let's move to Michigan. Well, let's not move to Michigan, but let's travel to Michigan. Who best endorses hate? Chris Christie would be fun. Donald Trump. Uh, Romney is in here. Paul Ryan, Rick Perry, Santorum. Ron Paul. Fuck it. Sarah Palin. We are having... S <laughs> I will win the nomination with Sarah Palin as my VP. Because I do not give a shit. <laughs> oh, man. I'm going to do it this time. I'm going to do what John McCain couldn't. Uh, build a headquarters. Upgrade set headquarters. Do some fighting ISIS. Hey, look at that. Halfway through, it's still a really nice, uh, really nice deal here. Um, let's move over to these really blue states. Oregon's quite the liberal state, so let's uh, let's uh, change that. We want the hippies to embrace the hate. Embrace the hate, hippies. Uh, I kind of like how legalization of marijuana and supporting green jobs is on the same thing. What is this? Uh, Political Machine 2016. I think it's like seven or ten bucks on uh, Steam. But no, fighting ISIS. That is what we are about here. Is War on Terror built up? Yes, it has. Nice. And securing the borders. We must hate the Mexicans as well. I'm going on the I'm going on a, a Trump-esque tirade of fighting terrorists and keeping Mexicans out. And we'll see how well this happens. Alright, she's helping me out there. I want to make sure these people know what I stand for. And we'll do a war on terror. Alright. Uh, let's see here. How much is Washington? Washington's 12. Alright. Yeah, Washington's slightly better than... Oh boy, I think Cal I think he's probably won California. Oh man. Okay, so I think we've pretty much secured Ohio, which is good, because that's one swing state. Uh, I don't like how some of these are. Ooh, we got Pennsylvania. That's another nice. That's like an underrated swing state right there. Like if, like if Florida and New York, like you should count Pennsylvania as well. I mean, it's pretty neat. It's a pretty nice one, Pennsylvania and. Pennsylvania and Illinois are like two like underrated swing states. It's like there's 20 points there at least. Uh, let's build more campaign headquarters while we have the money. Meanwhile, we shall fight ISIS and let people know about my plans to fight ISIS. Um, hang on as I try to maneuver this just a little bit here. There we go. I want to center this perfectly. There we go. Carrie gets the party started in California. Raises some cash. That's fine. We all about ISIS here. Where's that war on terror? The war on terror. Let's see. War on terror. Securing the borders. We need to build those up a little bit. More people may need to make that an issue. Let's move. We're going to go to Virginia and Tennessee while we still have a chance here. Let's go to Tennessee first. Uh, let's do that. Fighting ISIS. Let's see. War on Terror. We need to build up both of those, actually. That needs to be something more people need to be aware of.
War on terror. War on terror. And while I'm at it, what was it, Rhode Island? O'Malley scenario. Tonight on the O'Malley scenario, the far left once again has struck another blow to patriotism. Hopefully tonight's guest will set them straight. Good evening, I'm Bill O'Malley. Stay tuned. Lots of liberals out there who see these tragedies, these shootings where some sicko has gone crazy and shot a bunch of people, and these liberals are trying to use these tragedies to push their own agenda, gun control. They want to tear up the Second Amendment, how do you respond to these pinheads? No deal, it's in the Constitution. Our president has sold us out to Iran. This nuclear deal lifts sanctions against them so long as they promise to stop making nukes. Ridiculous, what do you think? Uh, we'll say it's a bad deal. All right. I did good. I did good. We gotta get a national organization to help us turn some people around. Gonna make people love me. We're gonna, we're gonna build a headquarters here in Rhode Island. Only four points, I don't care. Fighting ISIS. Let's go to Virginia where there's some actual funds here. Let's see. Man, this 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 is the one that could use some extra some extra bits and pieces for me to use. Because uh, I can just do some ISIS speeches. Alright. Minnesota, that's another. That's 10. That's 10. That's pretty nice. Yeah, you know, we need to make something of that. Still running, uh, still running pretty okay right now. 17 weeks left. Political opportunity in New Mexico. Let's see. We'll, we'll check that out maybe later. Let's build a headquarters here. Uh, War on Terror. Okay, we need to build up the War on Terror, and I'm going to use Minnesota to do it. My stamina increased. Good. War on Terror. Securing the borders needs to be up there, too. Uh, get another national organization. I don't think it's possible to make California swing my way. Or maybe even New York. But I can still maybe get Florida. If I try. So let's move this over here. And let's make sure. First off, let's get a bit of money. I forget what I have here. Alright. That's fine. ISIS. And ISIS. <laughs> Damn. I shouldn't have built the clout thing here. I should probably dismantle that clout building. Because I'm doing pretty well as it is, so let's see. There we go. Let's get that campaign headquarters up here so we can uh, get some other stuff here, like securing the borders. I'm going to use Florida to get my backup ideals up and running. We're looking slightly less good, which is what happened last time. That's fine. Okay, we're, we're, ga we're gaining some steam. Boy, they do, they do not like me. I love it. They hate me. More endorsements. There we go. Give a speech. Let's get securing the borders up there. And uh, War on Terror. We'll get another ad. We're going to take this... Get that up there. There we go. Now I can get the War on Terror. I want to make sure these people know 
Let's see. Redu oh, man, he's really kicking my ass with that reducing the wealth gap. I need to change that. All right, gun rights, war on terror. Okay, war on terror needs to go up. So we're going to do another war on terror ad. And then we'll go to... Let's go to Pennsylvania. All right. Let's build campaign headquarters. We're going to get the war on terror up there. This is Pennsylvania. I'm sure they'll love hate. There we go. You're going to go over here. They don't seem to care too much about Louisiana or Colorado. We'll take Colorado too while we're at it. There we go. Upgrade that building. Give a speech on the war on terror. We need to build that up. We need to make that a top priority. People are getting there. I think I I think I almost certainly have Ohio. Man, they're really trying to take Illinois from me too. Ooh. Okay. Yeah, he's pretty much got New York, I think. I think I can get Pennsylvania though. I still got a shot here. Uh, let's do securing the borders as well. And let's move to Illinois. Because he's just trying to steal Illinois from underneath of me. So let's not do that. Get more national organizations to help me out here. We're going to get a campaign headquarters, and we're going to keep doing this war on terror. Three things, that's all I'm doing. <laughs> we're getting up there. We're getting past the... Uh, I, I want to get past that climate change. There we go. Uh, let's see here. Wisconsin, Michigan. We'll stay here in Illinois for right now and fight this one out. Securing the borders while I'm at it. Build that and we'll move over here to Michigan. Try to combat that. Huh. They don't seem to like carry over there. Uh, who needs infrastructure when you have ISIS and terrorists to fight? Alright. Let's see. War on Terror needs to get up there too. Come on. Alright. Looks like it's made top three. Fighting ISIS, and then where should we go? Let's just take a week, come over here, secure Colorado. This should pretty much secure it for me just by being here. <clears throat> there we go. Why would they care about the legalization of marijuana? That's already a thing here. Alright. This one might get close. Alright, we're going to spend our last week in Florida. Because I'm pretty sure I got Ohio. I may or may not have Pennsylvania. Probably going to lose Illinois. Let's see if I can get Florida with this last bit. War on terror. War on terror. And then war on terror. 
All right. Says I might win here. Let's we'll see. I almost got up to where climate change is at, so that was pretty good. And fighting ISIS became a top priority that I was extremely good at, but it looks like I might win. I spent a shitload of clout. Oh my god. Alright, let's see. Cross your fingers. How did we do? Yeah, I, I, was, I wasn't going to get a lot of those. Especially New York. Did I get Pennsylvania? I want to know if I got Pennsylvania. Ah. Oh! Yay! There's one swing state, besides New York. Yay! Ohio and Florida. And Michigan. Come on. Oh, fuck you, Illinois. God damn it. I got Texas, at least. Come on, Missouri. All right. Damn. All right. Texas is a no-brainer. Oklahoma. This this whole middle this whole middle western area, this whole Rocky Mountain esque area should be mostly me. I won! I won! I did it. I spread the message of hate successfully to America with Sarah Palin as my vice president. <laughs> Oh my god, Hatebot5000 Sarah Palin ticket has won. I know I should probably go up in difficulty, but it's it's just so much fun. <laughs> Hooray! <laughs> see how the polls looked here. Man, I spent some time, at least in Pennsylvania, look at that, War on Terror fighting ISIS, and he's still just barely edged me out. At least I managed to get uh, Florida just barely on my side. I worked hard. So did Kerry. Or no, that wasn't Kerry. Where did Kerry end up at the end of this election? No, that's Gore. Where where'd John Kerry run off to? Why can't I... Oh, John Kerry went to Hawaii. Ah. Spending your campaign time in Hawaii, huh? I can see why they voted Hatebot in. Hatebot was hard at work. Well, you spent your last week on the beach. But yay! That's pretty nice. 330 electoral votes. That should be the... This should go over extremely well. I imagine this going over. Nothing. I, I should. Sarah Palin should be my VP every single time, no matter what. The hate bot Sarah Palin ticket is going to be the hot ticket every time I decide to play this now. All right. So thank you to people on YouTube who watch this. I'll do this again at some point. Take on more people since they seem to have added more people now. See you guys later.